Hello, everybody. We're here. We're here. We're here. 200 here. We're back to the episode of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda: Fire Princess. Last time, we we started the Goron Mines and we made it to the point where the mini boss is. And now let's go in and fight the mini boss. And we're off to a great start because I shot a bunch of stecacies and I sat on the controller and I pulled out the nunchucks. So yeah, fantastic. Let's go for the mini boss. I should ever start recording right here. But that's fine. Let's go put the iron boots on. Whoa! A human! What business does a human have here? Come here, here. None! No business! It's a forbidden place. I'll protect this treasure from you! Get is I'm a short cat, Long does not hurt a Goron. But on this game, a Goron can get hurt by Long. That makes no sense to me. Goron can get hurt on Majora's Man. A Goron can get hurt on Majora's Man. She'll be able to hurt a lot of I'm gonna do it one more time. And that'll be. Bam! Oh, nothing. Come on. Fucking asshole. Goodbye. Come on. Really? Well, I'm gonna get him this time. There's no way you can. We're gonna like this one. We're gonna get him this time. Goodbye. Boom! Oh, God damn it. Sorry about that, ladies and gentlemen. I moved my camera. Why? So this is such a magnificent episode, isn't it, folks? Oh, shit. God. Really? Oh. I can't believe I did that. I really can't believe I just put my foot in my cable and moved my mic and my, I moved my camera out of place. So I apologize for that. Anyway. That hurt a lot. It thought humans could be so poor, so capable of such feats of strength. Uh, maybe we are going to see the patriarch of our tribe? Mm. Oh, that's why you're here. In that case, take the weapon of, of the hero of past. In exchange, you must save the patriarch of our tribe. A lot of filling up. Gorons may be strong, but they have very low intelligence. Because, the you know, Ring Miss this guy doesn't know it, so... <laughs> uh. Gorons are not very intelligent, but they are very strong. Just like Zoras aren't very strong, but they are intelligent and really good at swimming. That's gonna have to do, I'm gonna have to sit like that. Cause, you know, you can't see my rupees, though. Damn it. No! Don't... Okay. There. Much better. Right. 
so there we go, let's fix the problem. Alright, let's go. I'm gonna have to... Sorry, be more careful with the camera. Because I'm not gonna cut this, because I'm not cutting it out because it's gonna take too much time to cut it out, so... So, boom. Boom. Let's shoot this thing here and... Come on. There we go. Make that fall over. All right. So here's the room. Fuck you, you fucking slugle, or whatever things are called. They're torch slugs. Sorry, they're torch slugs. So I had to focus, that's why I was quiet there for a moment. When you're aiming and sniping, and when you're aiming and shooting things, you have to be very careful, very, very concentrated, so. Alright, so let's go ahead and open this here, and voila! We got ourselves the compound! Yes, I just said like him, then the Macri Sun does. Anyway, let's kill this bitch over here, because you don't deserve it. Oh my cursing. Oh I really need to stop doing that, seriously. I mean, the more I curse them okay, I don't want to go in there yet, because that's the final thing there. Final key shard we need to get the key that we need to get into the area where the boss is, so You know, I could have just finished this dungeon last episode, but now so now I'll have time to like do collect the collect the and stuff like that. And then next episode we can make our way to the uh Next, next area is Twilight, so... Oh, well, I got to think of that's the cutscenes, too. The ending cutscene and the... Cut, the cutscene in the village before... Yeah, okay, so that's actually going to take more time than I thought. Why don't I not? I have time to like the piece of heart, that's about it. I want to do want to have some time to watch some videos tonight, so I'm going to stop the episode as soon as I get done with that there. If you don't touch I'm sorry, I'm stopping the episode. If I don't have time, then. You are here last! Oh, you my baby, this young human. I am fascinated. I'm farsighting all of the. the, the uh, the thing. Here you go. Take the last shard. Combine these three. We collect all three keys. Shards. They complete the big key. Here it's the boss. Use the key to open the door. So it's, it's in the room where Darvis is being held. The tribal of Hitcher is being held. Who knows how all the Darvis is growing in this gargantuan its form? But I suppose I should trust your power, considering that you came all this far. Hurry now, to the patriarch's side. Okay, we're not getting to that yet, let's go ahead and open this chest here. Let's steal this, let's steal this guy's money. Give me your money, we got 50 rupees from that! Yeah! I love, I love collecting rupees, it's fun. If I see a rupee, I just go, I just gotta collect it, cause you know... Greed is good, right? Nah, it's not. <laughs> Children, don't ever, don't ever be greedy. Greed is not good. Pretty much playing Warcraft in that case, then greed is good. But yeah. let me grab this here. Like, why just step away? Grab, grab the statue, pull it back. Thank you. Jeez, like it seems like you don't have a brain whatsoever. Like, you know, you do know, all the walls all the time, so... You know, with the walls and stuff. I'm gonna get rid of these guys before I go over there, so I don't have to worry about wasting my arrows to kill those guys. view.
Well, really? No arrows? Oh, okay, there's probably arrows here. I have to have arrows. There we go. 13 arrows. I have three arrows. I'm not gonna, there's no way I'm gonna survive three arrows. Three arrows. Arrows, so... So far, so good, and I'm being quiet, I need to talk. That's what, that's what the Let's Play is about, it's commentary. So yeah. And I really have nothing to talk about, I ran off stuff to talk about. So, I'll just start talking about nonsense, probably. Knowing me. Right, so let's go ahead and hit this switch. Boom. Back, but I need arrows. And I really need those. Let's go. I have seven arrows left. Oh, great. Oh well. I guess I deal with it for now. Oh, I have only five. I have five. I'm five over. God damn, it sucks. I had max rupees by the time I finished this. Alright, so we're gonna shoot this here. I cannot remember where we're just for so. Some people have now have arrows in them, so. Some people now have arrows in them. Hopefully. Nope, no arrows. Great. Nope, there's no arrow here. I really need some more arrows. Right. Oh, no, no, I have 26 now. Okay. I'm good to go for now. Only we'll eventually, though. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I kill those enemies with projectiles. You don't need to kill them, but it's easier to kill them because they'll hit you with. Uh, they keep hassling. They keep hassling you with their projectiles until you kill them. And I can still remember what that says. Then this room, let's go ahead and head to the room where the boss was again. Oh, we got 15 minutes. Oh, okay. This record this uh, record the collectathon in this episode still, just so I can get that out of the way. Um, well, he's dead now. I jumped in the water, so.
Why did you just jump to the other side, Link? Seriously? <laughs> jump like that, then. So, yeah, watch my mad sniping skills here. I don't even need a. I don't even need a special item to make me help me snipe. I just missed that one though, so I need to be careful. Now, if you wouldn't have taken those guys out, they would have, they would have alerted the other ones, and then you would have had a whole hassle of them hitting you. And as long as you shoot those guys when they're moving, trust me. Alright. As long as you hit those guys when they're shooting at you, because they can, they can hit you first, and then you wouldn't be able to hit them because you wouldn't be able to get a shot off, so... So it's only been a good 45 minutes so far, if I would have continued recording that episode. So good thing I broke down to two parts. I think that's what I'm going to do from now on is every episode I'm breaking down to two parts. So, I think that's what I'm going to do anyway. For now. Until I figure something else out. Oh crap, you know what? Okay, you know what I'm going to do real quick? I'm going to jump off of here. I can just come back there anytime I want. Because I want to get this out of the way first, so that way I can actually get it. The uh, third just go over there right away, and I have to worry about trying to get the. Yeah, if you aim this right, you can shoot the rope. That's not right. There we go. And then we'll you can make the bridge go down early. Uh, now you have to shoot, if you don't do that, you have to shoot the bridge and then shoot that and then. Have to go all the way back again, which I'd rather go back. I'd rather drop off on the first trip, so I'd rather drop, get to depart on the first trip, not wait, wait, not have the thing go back up for a second trip. So yeah. Let's put this here. I just, uh, I don't know if there was a way you could do that, but I forgot the, the first time I tried to play this game again. See, the first time I played this game, I was, it was a GameCube version of this game. And I never got 100% in the GameCube version of this game. And, uh, no. Okay, you. You and I. Boss, and make sure you fill up. Just to make sure you fill back up. Because you need arrows for the boss. So, like they make you use the dungeon item against the boss. So, in every one of these dungeons. So, charge! Yeah, I took all those you guys out like a boss. Alright, now let's get something here. And fuck my screensaver. I'll get it. Alright, so, ladies and gentlemen, are you ready for this? Let's go. I try to get these two arrows here. Let's go in and fight the boss. It's your free paint truck from the spell.
on fire. What's wrong with you? Literally, you're on fire. Well, I like lighter. Virus. And let's go. So he has two different types of attack. He has a blast attack and he has a chain attack that he just hit me with. I shot his eye. So you have to shoot his eye as a weakness. Pretty much the uh, read you know, just because you see eyes locked and that's this game's uh, primary is all the eye weakness, so it's all the boss that's coming out. So what you're going to do is you take thought, reach, the chain, and move your switch in, and boom, 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 boom. Alright. So I'm going to your position here, so my thing back on. As soon as he slides himself back up again, so he's slide back down, shoot again, and then boom. The special boss is like no sweat. Bugs like. It's super easy and there's no way you can lose against it, unless you're terrible this game, of course. They you lose if you're terrible at the game, but I'm not terrible at the game. I'm really good at the game, actually. The dying is not intended to happen, by the way, for those of you who are wondering. She was like, hey, Rhaegar, did you die on purpose? I'm like, no, I'm not on purpose to show that off. Hello. Hello. Oh. And... Goodbye. You're going down, and this is your last hit. This is the last cycle. You have to select the boss three times. Oh. Drop, drop that. That we got Save the Shadow. <laughs> well done. Now we have two of your shadows. Hmm, you know, you've been very helpful so far, so I'll reward you. As, as, so as a reward, I'll tell you an interesting story. Zant. That's the name of the King of Darkness that ca that who cast the pall the this pall of dark of shadows over your world. He's very strong. You'd be nothing to him in your current state. But Zant will never be my king. I have nothing but the scorn for the, his supposed strength. Now that your Zelda's not that your Zelda's much better, it still appeals to me that it still appalls to me that the world of light is controlled by that princess. And can care for youth whose life is a luxury, life, who lives, who's a life, a life of luxury. How does that teach the duty? But I guess we should, I shouldn't bar, bar, begrudge her. And the circumstances of her life, she did not choose it after all. And, well, I would never wish to harm her. Harm her. Nope, as long as I have a few shots and I get my hands on, as long as I feel, I'll be just fine. Well, just one more. Left. Shall we? <laughs> Alright. Okay, so finally the dungeon's over with. Let's go ahead and grab our heart container. <laughs> we got six heart containers now. We have seven after this. So let's go ahead and go leave. And I'm going to go ahead and do this right now and get this over with.
the fetch quest out of the way real quick. Well, not the fetch quest, the uh, item gathering. The piece of hard catching and the bug. Well, I'm not going to do the bug catching until we're on our way to the next area, so... I'm just going to get a piece of heart and get those out of the way and then we end the episode off. There we go, two hearts added to our uh, defense. Heart real quick and then I'm gonna end off the episode. And then, I, and then I'm heading to bed, so. Let's go ahead and, uh. Oh, we're getting three pieces of heart this episode, okay. So, the first place I wanna go is over here to, uh, this little shop over here. Do you remember Barnes Bombs was closed because we, um, destroyed his little, uh, shop over there? And I rolled into a door. Alright, I'm going to get these two pieces of heart out of the way and get them over with. I'm going to get the other one later, because we can get that one before we head to make our way to the next area, so. Oh. Hey, bud. Hey, now, bud. How about this now? Yep, I finally managed to get my numbers together. I've opened my shop again. Well, sort of. I guess I only have one type of bomb. But hey, that's more than none, right? If I... If only I store... If only my storehouse had survived. But, hey, ain't as bad as that. Okay, so let's buy it. What's this? You ain't got no bomb bag. You want to carry for carrying bombs, huh? I've got a special offer going on right now. My bomb bag, premium kit. It was cost you 120 rupees. Let's buy it. That's right. You got a taste, blah blah blah. See you later, blah blah blah. I've got to tell you, I'm just like speed through the text. I'm trying to get done to this as quick as I can, so. Anyway, lanterns are prohibited. I'll show you what happens uh, some other time when we uh, when you take lanterns out in a shop. There's two things that happen when you take out anything in a lantern in the shop. So, yeah. Anyway, let's go ahead and uh, go pull up these rocks. So, what we're going to do here is we're going to put these. Bomb, 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 bomb
ruffle this too as soon as I get done here because I need to get it's not gonna take that long so I just need to rename it and all that stuff. Alright, so so I don't shoot those rocks there. And shoot these rocks here. There we go. So we got this one over here first, because this is the quickest one to get. Oh, no, no, wait, wait. The one up top is close to get first. Hey. Super close. Further back here. Alright, one more, and then I'm going to end off the episode. Yeah. So let's push this episode off real quick before I get this here. Now we get ourselves in the heart container. episode of Let's Play Legend of Let's Fire Princess. Next time, we are going to go and we're going to make our way to the Lanaru province. So if you like this video, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you like my video, if you know, like my videos, subscribe to my channel. It really helps you subscribe to my channel, support my channel. Also make sure you leave your positive comments down below and make sure you don't forget to answer the comment question of the day, which was, what is your favorite Mario game? 3D Mario game, sorry, 3D Mario game. And, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll tell you my favorite uh, next session. Since we're at Target, signing off. Peace out.